Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. The eclipse energy from the Ring of Fire eclipse just went, just happened to us on the 21st. So, this will be the energy from that eclipse. This is a timeless reading. Remember to take what resonates and leave the rest of it. We're going to do um, just a Celtic spread, which is just a single spread for my Tauruses. Taurian babies. Hope everybody's doing well. Let's get present energy. Whoa. Present energy for Taurus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. and energy for Taurus. Divine couple. Ah, what's well crossing the Pisces, or the Pisces. I don't know why I just called that Pisces, Taurus, unless you're dealing with the Pisces. This is what cross, what's crossing the situation. If somebody is offering that cup of love, yeah. If it turns into a love reading, it turns into a love reading. I, you know, I don't know what the energy is going to bring until it begins. Let's find out what's in the dis. Whoa, what's in the distant past? Those did not turn up. I'm not taking them. So, the distant past for Taurus. Uh, okay, a couple popping out there. Ooh. Looks like maybe you had to move on from a situation, Taurus, in the past the distant past, something that was kind of disappointing or left you in a grief-stricken kind of state of state of uh, emotions because cups are all about emotions and that's the five of cups and this is this is moving fast energy it's also my player card so you might have been played in the past okay Let's see what uh, the most recent uh, or past is, and that's you taking a leap of faith. The fool. This is this is you coming out of this energy here and taking a brand new leap of faith and start in something else. This is in your best possible outcome, but we're going to get some more information on that. Alright? Best possible outcome is for your world to get rocked. And that's pretty much how I'm feeling that. Um, not saying in a bad way. Maybe in a really good way, because I don't feel anything negative about this, this uh, reading at all. Usually if something was detrimental or hurtful or something I would feel it could be dealing with a Virgo here um, this is whatever this tower is it's gonna it's gonna cause you to go within and seek your answers that's it that's pretty much how that's it, this whatever situation is your best possible outcome and like I said I don't feel like it's a bad thing I feel like maybe it's like an unexpected marriage proposal, almost. And I think it freaks you out. Okay, so I don't think that's anything uh, materially coming down. But you know, I could be wrong. I'm, everybody's got their own situation. Um. It just feels like maybe some real unexpected news comes in. And maybe that's the news you need to shake you up. Because, you know, you're going to have to leave things to divine timing. And, and that is difficult for most Taurus, as I know. I've had a few of them in my life as my sibling was a Taurus, so. And he's no longer with us, but... 
He was, yeah, he was your typical Taurus. Um, we got the two of, two of Wands here in the future, in the immediate future. Shows me, Taurus, that you're going to have to make a choice between the past and the future. We got conflict here about that. All right. You're going to have to really see if you're going to take this brand new start because um, I think in the future energy you're going to you're going to be conflicted about it. You know. You don't I don't think you know what to do here. You're wondering if it's it's illusions possibly with the cancer. Somebody who's you think this is whoever this person is, you think that at this point in time and in the very immediate future, well these are timeless, so you'll see it when you see it. But that tells me that you don't believe that this person is coming in to help you. You don't you don't you don't feel like uh you have any support is what I'm hearing uh, in this situation and you're afraid that it's all illusion okay um, let's get some more information find out uh, factors affecting the situation is the hangman okay so that's being in, suspended in it in suspended animation, indecisiveness, um, not knowing which route to take. Let's see what, uh, and just kind of sitting still until you get yourself illuminated. Let's get to, uh, outside influences. This could be somebody you just had a fight with in the recent past, okay? Because I'm feeling that. I'm, I'm feeling like there was somebody you had a fight with. And that's why you were emotionally withdrawn. And then they, they, they may have come back. And that's what this is. They may have come back. And this time they're real serious about their intention. But there were some harsh words said here between the two of you. Hopes and fears. Eight of Pentacles. You're going to work at it. Great. Cool. That's awesome. Let's see what the uh, final outcome brings us. It's pretty cut and dry here, Taurus. Whoever coming back in is, is very serious. Wow. Ace of Wands brand new fiery start here and passion and you know hot stuff that's that's hot stuff there could be this knight of wands turned into an ace I don't know I'm just saying that's how it's feeling is whatever you were disappointed by in the distant past you observed it to be a big illusion um what we got on the bottom too, page of wands. So this is this is a brand new start for you, Taurus. Fiery one. And the best thing you can do is shake up your shake shake up your foundations and make you make you think about it and go within. Because when you go within and you seek your answers, you usually find them a lot faster than trying to go outside of yourself to find those answers. Okay, that's just the way the cookie crumbles there. If you if you look outside yourself for answers, you'll never find them. You'll never find them. You have whatever answers you need to make a decision about your future or past at this point. And if it goes the way that you want it to, you'll have that brand new carefree start. Okay, let's go get a couple of uh, romance angels and I'll pull some uh, psychic tarot 
and uh, we have Work Your Light and Wisdom of the Hidden Realms. So, let's see what the romance is will bring us. Mm. Energy for my Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. got stay optimistic about your love life positive thinking will bring you romance and worth waiting for divine timing is at work in your love life yep and time apart from time apart from your partners on the horizon okay all right so how i'm seeing that is that you guys might already be separated all right but whatever you have between yourselves is worth waiting for so stay optimistic about it all right because this is divinely guided whatever this is divinely guided let me get uh, some psychic tarot here let's see what we can find from that get some more advice have such a magnetic charge to them. They are intense. I know other people use them, but wow. They're very magnetically drawn to each other. New beginnings. Zero point. Zero point. You are coming into zero point energy, Taurus. Where this is all going to be brand new. Whatever this old situation may have been. There's new beginnings here. We got obstacles and challenges. Well, we already see that here. And a lot of it is your own obstacles and challenges. But, like I said, some, some words were spoken here that were, you know, this is all about communication. So, Five of Swords, you know, saying that there were some really heavy words said that caused this situation. And y'all need to... Solitude, yeah solitude this is this is gonna make you guys withdraw male or female because of the obstacles and challenges you're, you're kind of withdrawing in solitude to seek your answers in the long run get conflict and defeat here too you're going to have a brand new beginning from this conflict and defeat, Taurus. That's, that's pretty apparent. All right. And then we got prosperity begins. So, in whatever this heavy emotional situation was, uh, you're going to get a new beginning out of it. I mean, I got every new beginning card on here. Ace of Wands, Page of Wands, Knight of Wands, moving and shaking the pool. So there's a there's definitely a new beginning coming here for you. And don't count on anybody else to write in and save the day. Taurus, save yourself. Save your own self. Because the chariot tells me that. You think of it as an illusion. 
and what you think becomes remember that so carry your carry your energy as light as possible don't expect anything and you won't be disappointed I don't know why I said that it just was something that was brought to my attention so don't break your own heart don't disappoint yourself Deep replenishment. <laughs> okay, this is why the um, the separation needs to happen. If it hasn't already, we need retreat, rest, and be held. Both of you probably need to hold yourselves right now and and rest from from all this. Looks like a lot of work. Okay. There's a lot going on here. A lot of... Yeah. Somebody needs to go within really, really deep here. And make sure that... When they come back out of the solitude... And, and, and try to... And, and challenge themselves. Take care of these obstacles. And these challenges. Go within... Find your answers to these obstacles and challenges. And from conflict and defeat comes a new beginning. Alright? And deep replenishment is needed for your soul. That is what it's asking. You need to rest, retreat, and just be in your own loving energy. Love yourself. It's time for you to go and love yourself. But somebody is offering here, guys. You know, there is an offer on the table, and it is a divine counterpart. This was meant to come for you. Yeah, I'll be right out. Okay. Thank you. We get the Eagle King in reverse. So, the big picture. Let's go. Sorry, guys. Sorry for the interruption. It's cool, though. Um. Yeah, that's the Eagle King. I'm trying to remember which one that was. In reverse. So, somebody's not seeing the big picture here. Somebody's not seeing the, uh, well, so I'll read it to you, okay? Yet the Eagle King challenges you to see a higher purpose to events. Not everything is meant to come to pass according to your specifications. If you can't see the forest for the trees, stand back for a while and let the Eagle, cl the Eagle King fly high on your behalf, otherwise known as your, for as your higher self. I threw that in. It wasn't in the book. But that's what I'm saying. You have to go through this deep within and find your higher self to understand where this new beginning starts. Okay, because there, there are so many new beginning cards on here. Plus, you got the new beginning from the Psychic Tarot. So whatever has been, see the higher perspective of it so you can replenish yourself and get back out there in the world. Perhaps it's time to speak to someone who has an objectivity and, an, and the ability to see the bigger picture where you don't. Just remember that even when things don't go your, the way you expect, there's always a reason for the detour. Okay? So there was a reason for this detour. But it's, it's worth waiting for. I mean, that's what it feels like to me. I mean, it might not be that you're deciding to do that right now. And maybe not even in the immediate future. But it leads to a brand new start. No matter what you do, you're you're working at that. You're working at it. And that's 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 just gorgeous. Okay? Ooh, that was intense. 
<laughs> well, I hope you liked it. Please subscribe, share, and like if you did. And I will see you guys next week, okay? Until then, stay safe, stay well, take care. Bye for now.